Cláudia é foda, né? How y'all doing today? It's your boy, the one and only King Trent TV, and I'm back for another video. I want to talk about the Baltimore Ravens versus the um, LA Rams. Yeah, I want to get into it. Um, the Ravens have to take on the, the Los Angeles Rams this Sunday, and this is going to be one of those type of games you can't sleep on because um, even though it's the NFC opponents and the Ravens been killing NFC opponents this year, the problem is this is not a regular in the sea opponent. This is a um, opponent right here where where they w was former Super Bowl champions. They got the Super Bowl pedigree. They know how to win football games. They see what they did to the Browns last week, and um, and I ain't gonna lie, they the the, the Rams are scary. They they one of those type of sneaky scary teams you just don't want to sleep on, and. Just because they've been having a bad season or their season been started out a little slow, you just don't want to um, sit there and um, and unamest the uh, Browns. You don't want unamest the unamest the Browns and all that. I mean, unamest the um, Rams and all that shit. So the Rams will put up a fight against the Ravens this Sunday, and I expect something to happen. Um. So. I expect the the Ravens. So the Ravens gonna have to come out with fire pedigree, coming off the bye. We gonna have to um put these boys to bed early. I'm talking about put up two three scores on these guys. Go up through two to three scores to, to to put these guys away. Cause if you sit there and let the Rams stay into this game, they gonna fucking find a way to win this motherfucking ball game. They gonna find a way to win this game. If you let the Rams stay, you know what I'm saying? If you let the Rams stay in this ball game, they want to find a way to win. That guy Puka, Kula, that that guy Puka, you do not want to um you don't want you don't want to sit here and let him get go off cuz oh my god, me. You don't want to let this guy to go off and shit cuz um Puka is he's nice. He's he's nice. That that brother is nice. Um, I'm sorry. You, you, yeah, that brother's nice. Him and Cooper Cup is nice, but mainly it's been the Puka show this year for them. And you don't want um that guy Puka to go off. Definitely don't want that guy to go off. Cause if he go off, if he catch fire, and he, if he feel like that he can go off and explode, man, the, the Rams is going. You know, you know what the Rams gonna do? They gonna sit there. They gonna look at us like this. And they're going to kick our asses. They're going to sit there and look at us like this. And they're going to kick our asses. I'm going to tell y'all right now. We're going to get our ass kicked. We're going to get our ass kicked if we, if we don't um, maintain this guy Puka. You know what I'm saying? If we let him get loose, I swear, we're going to get our ass whooped. And I don't want. And for us to get our ass whooped by a team like the Rams, it will hurt. It will definitely hurt. So, the Ravens defense... I'm gonna talk about something with the Ravens defense must do. The Ravens defense must um make sure Puka is limited in catches. Make sure both Cooper Cup and Puka is limited. But especially um I would say especially Puka. I would say especially Puka. Make sure he's limited in his catches. So make sure they find another guy. Let somebody else beat you. Let one of the other uh, receivers beat you. You know what I'm saying? And, um, yeah, and make sure um, Matthew Stafford is not comfortable in the pocket, too. So, you want to make sure Matthew Stafford's job is much hard. It's hard on him. So, you want, um, the pass rush guy to get to him. We got to sack that boy. We got to sack that brother to the ground. And we got to make sure, um, we got to make sure that's got to happen. You know what I'm saying? We got to make sure that definitely happens. So we got to make sure we got to get a sack up against um those guys. Make sure um the defense put him on the ground and make sure um we uh solidify this win. So that means the Ravens going to have to do their job. They got to do their diligence and they got to really make sure 
they do their job really good because if um puka and those guys go off we gonna have a bad day it's gonna be a bad day if, if puka and those guys is going off and they scoring touchdowns and all that shit but <clears throat> excuse me but um let's talk about the ravens offense real quick obj this is an obj type game OBJ, I think this is this has to be an OBJ type game. I think OBJ has to go off. OBJ had to go off. This is an OBJ type game. Uh, oh, excuse me. I think this is a Zay Flowers game too. I think Zay gotta go off too. We need Zay to get get targets, get him involved. Um, Rashad Bateman can get a little bit mixed of it too. You know, what I'm saying a little sprinkle there with with Rashad Bateman. And all that shit. Nelson Aguilar, if 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 anything else, Nelson Aguilar can go off too if he wants to. But we need our wide receivers to be productive. We just need them guys to do one thing, and that's to catch the fucking ball. <laughs> that's just for them to catch the ball. We need those guys to catch the fucking ball, and we need those guys to perform. You know what I'm saying? We need those guys to perform, and if they perform, we'll definitely win this game. If they perform good, we'll definitely win this game. So. And also, I want to talk about Lamar Jackson. He has to be efficient. He has to be efficient. No turnovers, no interceptions, no fumbles from that guy. We need. He needs to have a good passing game. You know what I'm saying? Get passing the ball real good. I want him to throw for maybe, maybe close to 300 yards. Maybe, maybe two, but 300, two to 300 yards. Maybe the TDs I want him to get. In this game is probably honestly he can he can get two t touchdowns two touchdowns or three three to two touchdowns it will be good three to two touchdowns if he but Jackson five if he gets a Jackson five in this game hey if he has a Jackson five then hey that's that's real good that's 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 fucking great but we just gotta see how it goes because um. That off our offensive line been a little shaky, you know what I'm saying? The only thing about the bad thing about it is our offensive line. Our offensive line been real shaky, and and we gotta go up against Aaron Donald in their defense. And Aaron Donald is a um sack machine, and you it's just the thing with Aaron Donald. And you just you it's, you just gotta watch out for him. He he can wreck the game. He definitely can wreck the game. So you, I would say make sure Aaron Donald don't get to Lamar Jackson. I would say protect Lamar and we should be fine. So that's all I got for y'all today. Leave a like it below. Leave a comment what y'all think about this game. And also subscribe to your boy. My name is King Trent TV and I catch y'all later. Peace out, my friends. Open this eyes after hiding from the storm. Try to patch all this hole, yeah. I'm a fucking dog.